Hi guys, we're back at Macro. Hi guys, <laughs> back again. Yeah, what we're doing is we're just setting up and uh, once we get something going, we'll bring you back. Well, we're on oh. a... It's a bit short and sweet, isn't it? Yeah, I know. What are you in a rush I for? I am short and sweet. <laughs> well, short, I'll give you that. <laughs> yes, we're down here having a, a fish today. So, I'm just going to bait Lisa up. She's got a, a normal setup and she's got a pulley, pulley rig. rig. And she wants a worm on to start. Her choice. Yeah. Bait. Tide's dropping. So, high yeah. tide, I think, as far as I remember, it was... And half nine, ten o'clock sort of ish time, like that, yeah. and it's dropping down. It's five past eleven, so we're going to fish the run down of it it's today. Quite a bit, isn't it? There's a little bit of pull, but yeah. the, there's quite a few people fishing down here. I'll just show yeah. you. There's quite a few down here, down yeah, there. So, the okay, it. Kev's down there. So, um, there's been a few, few little um, flat is caught, a couple of white and caught, rockling. One, one cod, he said the other. Five. No, that was. Some, before that, that was before? not today. Oh, not today. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna go and put this worm on. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna have to learn to bait her own hook soon. One day, one day, guys. But <laughs> considering, uh, I can do the worm, but it's that it's that bit that when you attach the, the other. Yeah, well, you want just worm? And uh, yeah, I'll put you just, just worm. worm at the moment. Just okay. worm. Put that through. You've got pulley panels, so you've got two hooks there. Yeah. Pop that in there, pop that down there. It's one, two, three, four. Yeah, uh, you're going to have to say, learn to bait your own hooks up, but yeah. I'll, I'll do it today because today yeah. is our, our wedding, wedding, anniversary. wedding anniversary. So we've come down to have a fish. I ain't even got, yeah. I ain't, I've got, oh, I haven't even got my rigs on yet. Yeah, see. So, real gent, real gent. I am a real gent. Gets me you know, I am first. <laughs> very thoughtful actually. Because uh, new today, guys. I'm, I'm giving luck. <laughs> I'm doing these. Are new today? I got myself a couple of pen mag fours. Okay, <laughs> to go on my rods here, and I even put blue braid on it. Look yeah. at that. How <laughs> pathetic am I? I even put a blue top on today because I'm fishing black and blue. Yeah. <laughs> it's sad, isn't it? But the fish will know. The you fish. know, they will know if I'm not matching. Now, I think I'm very, very, very thoughtful here because yeah. I bought these, a pair of these for myself for my wedding anniversary because I thought if Lisa forgets to get me something, she's going to feel really bad. So I thought if I say to her, ah, it's all right, I've already bought myself something, make her feel better. And that thoughtful. Yeah. I think so, guys. You know, that's what you should do. Well, that's all right because I already bought myself something as well. So. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 we don't bother with that sort of thing because we have stuff and we just buy we stuff buy it all we the time. <laughs> so there's no presents I've got. I couldn't get her anything she ain't already got. No. <laughs> but I thought it was thoughtful. Thoughtful. thoughtful it it was my, my excuse for doing it. <laughs> so there you go. Right. Got to get these hooks off. Right, so okay guys, I'm gonna get um set up and what we'll do is we'll bring it back if we get anything. Well, not when we get anything, when we get fishing. Yeah, once we get fishing. Okay, right, guys, I think I might have got something on mine. It's got a few good knots there. It's been getting, yeah, it's been getting <laughs> little bites, so she's going to gonna have a look. We'll bring it back just in case she's got something on there. <laughs> Rockling and, and a, a rockling. Right, let some line out. Don't forget, hold the spool. Don't do holding the spool. <laughs> right, go on, let some Is line down. Go on, go on. Right, that's it, you can put the rock down now. Okay. <laughs> 
I've well, got two in one go. Look at that, she's got a panel on, she's got a rockling <laughs> and a flounder together. <laughs> one on each other. <laughs> right, so we'll pop you right in there. And both lip hooks, so that's handy. Cool. So that's the rockling. Pop you in the back. <laughs> And there's a little flounder. Cool. Look at that, beautiful little, little flounder. There we go, pop him back. I saw those knocks really good as well. Yeah. That's it, he's gone. Yeah, you, you, you have a tendency I've to wind up too far yeah. and then you'll never get your fish. <laughs> well, there you go. Two You've only one. got 10 minutes of being there. <laughs> that's just being a bit greedy, that is. <laughs> that's not weed, that's like paper or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. A bit of an old tampon or something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. There you go, that's all good. Rub out a little bit. Yeah. New worm now. So that was all right, wasn't it? <laughs> See the worm. I think the worm. No, oh, they seem to your, want that worm. Your salty worm. You can hear that <laughs> clicking there. Yeah. Uh, oh, is that what it does? It's the one on the right. Yeah, it's got line pulling off on it. Yeah. Right, can you do a worm? I can try and do a right, worm. Right, we'll bring you back in a minute, guys. <laughs> Right guys, Glenn's just winding in and I think it's got a fish on there. <laughs> hey! Oh my that's God, look at that. Not a whole squid. Oh, not a whole squid. <laughs> He's a greedy bugger, that one. <laughs> that flounder's taken a whole squid. <laughs> oh, <laughs> look at that. Oh, it's flapped in my face. <laughs> it is flapped in your face. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. 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 Look He's taking a whole squid. There you go, we've got a flounder each. Well, we're not blanking. We're not blanking again. <laughs> Come on, let go. And that's it. And it's near the yep. thing as well, so that's good. Oh, back is gone. Yep, it's gone. Oh, he did. I, I didn't do a no, nose dive. Yeah. <laughs> right, guys, we'll bring you back in a minute. Just give us time to bait up again. Well, I'll bring you back for a minute, guys. So. <laughs> Found reach and Lisa's had a rock thing as well. Two on one, that's being crazy, that isn't it? <laughs> it's not the sort of thing we do, really. No, look, look, look. Real <laughs> girls fish. Real girls fish. <laughs> do With that. Fish on, two at a time. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> <laughs> no, so that's good. Flounder, at least we ain't blanked. Good, yeah. We haven't blanked, so that's a good thing. Hoping for a bit more than that. I wasn't expecting to get a flounder on a whole squid, but there you go, never mind. Goes to show. They're liking the squid though, isn't it? So, so yeah. And the worm. The worm's yeah. doing good, isn't it? Yeah, no, I'll fish and one of you one of your new reels. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so yeah, I thought I'd get those. Um I've got the original pen 525s, I've got the Mag 2s, I've got Mag 3s. I never liked them when I first come out, blue and black, but I thought, well, actually, it I've got goes. my six and baits are blue and black, so I thought, well, I'll put them on that. So there you go. Silly, really, but there, never mind. <laughs> it's got the OCD something thing, isn't it? Do, isn't it? So I've got the, the Mag 4s now, so as well. So I've got different reels for different rods. And very nice actually. And I've only had a couple of casts here with them, and yeah, they do actually. I do go out very nice. Yeah, very nice. But I've put a uh, 65 pound braid straight through on that. I'm not using lead because I'm not casting. I'm not heavy casting here, and I find using a leader, you just get that weed gets on that knot, and it's always when you got that fish on, then you get that big clump, and you can't get it in. So I thought I'd go 65 pound straight through. I was going to go 100, but that's a bit too thick, the diameter. This is um, 0.37, this, which is thicker than what I'd normally have. I'd normally go for um, 0.20, I think my other braid is, 0.23, something like that. So this is a bit thicker, but it's, it's not catching too much in the tide, it's all right. So yeah, all fun, there you go, that's enough about that. <laughs> Hopefully you just get some fish. Yeah. 
and just saying hi to Andy who we met earlier he's with one his of dog. our yeah with his little dog Bella Bella so yeah <laughs> he's uh one of our subscribers yeah. he watches so he come along he got a, he got a bait needle <laughs> come and said hello which as I did say if you come and say hello you get a free bait needle you've seen me make them up yeah. don't come right this minute because I've given away what I had and I've got I've, I've, I've <laughs> got, got a one box left. at home <laughs> you need to make some more yeah, yeah I've got one left to give away <laughs> so there you go um but that's it and I've got more at home made up and I've yeah. got some more to make up so not a problem <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll just see what happens. It's a very misty day. There's been a lot of whiting, a lot of haddock, and a lot of cod being caught around. Yeah. I think most of it on the beaches, but um, I think the last. I've, I did watch um, a couple that were fishing. Uh, Mike White he was fishing oh, down at um, Easington. I think he fished Sunday, yesterday. And he, no, he didn't get nothing there, so I think they might be off on the beaches at the moment. Don't to do with the tides and Hopefully stuff, I suppose. Hopefully they're coming up here. <laughs> Hopefully they're coming more into the river, yeah. Well, they were getting them, weren't they? They've been getting them at Paul. I yeah. mean, Paul, I think, was rammed yesterday because, uh, obviously, people have seen theirs. They've been catching them there. Uh, so, yeah, that was quite busy up there. But we were going to go for the beach today, but it's just the time, and it? We lose... We lose a couple of hours in travelling, travelling there, yeah. um, and we just Doing haven't that. got that time. I haven't got that time to spend at the moment. So here's nice. I can come down to here, yeah. and we're catching. <laughs> and we're catching. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I'm not overweight. Yeah, it'd be nice to get a cod, but I've, I've caught plenty in the past, so I'm not really bad. I just come for the fun now and just do a bit of fishing. As long as I catch, I don't mind. I like to catch a fish. Yeah. I, I don't like blanking. I've never liked blanking, but I don't yeah, mind as long as I catch. Up. Kev's packing up. Yeah, Kev's packing up. He, I don't think he likes fishing right over the low, does no. he? See, I've found I like the, the actual low wall, but low's not until, I think, 10 to 3 today. So you've got another three hours, I think, before dead low. Oh, right. I'm sure it was. 2.50, I think. Yeah. Yeah. It's so, so the uncovering down there. You're getting, seat, you're getting weed on yours, isn't it? Yeah, both have got weed on them. That's all right, though. Mm -hmm. It's not bad weed. Mm -hmm. It's not like the beach. Oh, the, the beach the has been a pain. So it's like Kilnsey. Yeah, we went. Kilnsey didn't want so much mm -hmm. weed there. And, oh, can't be doing with that. I want happy, easy fishing nowadays. <laughs> I've done all that sort of fishing. I don't want to put up with that. Fun for the fun of it. Yeah. Real fun. Oh, now I'm getting a rattle. There you go. That's on me whole squid a bit. See, it's loving no, it's not. Squid. No, oh. it's not. I've changed the rods over. Oh. <laughs> it's not. This so what have you got on the other one? Squid and lug. Squid on there. and worm, yeah. But right, there's definitely a little bite there. It's left hand rod. Mm. Left hand gave a little bite. I believe you see you can see them at the moment. I can't zoom you in because the way the camera, I can't zoom it in anymore. Than yeah, when it. So, <laughs> but I think you can actually see it when I look, when I check, when I upload these. You can actually see um, the rods and the bicycle. If I don't keep putting my head in the way, obviously. <laughs> Give it a little pull down, so it mm. might, might be on there. I'll just give it a minute to see. So you so said they, like the flounders, they give an initial um, like tug on it, and, yeah. then, and then it sort of they take, sits can tend there. to sit there, yeah. They tend to give that a couple of bites and then just sit. But apparently, there was a, I think last week, there was a five five or six pound cod caught along here mm -hmm. just just here actually just down there yeah five or six pound so they're about they're in the river they're there you've got to be here you have to, to get it oh there i'll go another little rattle just gave a little dum -dum. 
probably sat there swallowing swar that bugger. Yeah. yeah. Got a pulley panel on that one. I've got an up and over on the so whole squid, and I've got a pulley panel on that one. So I've only got the one hook, so I'm not waiting. I'm just waiting to see if it gives a bit better bite. I'm actually waiting for another fish to get on it because mm. it won't. And I've got a pulley so. pen, pe a pulley rig, pull, rig, pulley rig. What is it? Spit out, girl, come pulley, on. Pulley rig. Girls can fish. Girl. Yeah, pulley rig. <laughs> a pulley panel, yeah. Pulley you panel got a pulley rig. Pulley panel. That's what you got, pulley yeah. Pulley panel rig. Oh, it's a bit yeah. of a tongue twister when you think. The pulley is the rig, because yeah. it and works as a pulley. And the panel is the hook set up. Panel. You've got a panel rig, so you've got two two hooks. Pulley. Yeah. Pulley. So they call it a pulley panel. If you had one hook, it would just be a pulley. Oh, right. A single hook pulley rig. Mm. Pulley panel rig. Pulley rig is so that when you get a fish on, the weight of the fish pulls the lead pulls up yeah. out of the way, yeah. and that's why you're not catching your leg on there yeah. now when you get a fish on. That's it. That's the problem I'm having. That's why I put you onto a pulley because you was when you when yeah. she was getting a fish coming, she'd have the that's fish, the down, yeah, yeah. and the lead was hanging, and the lead was catching on the rock because she couldn't lift it up. The lead was getting caught on the rock there down the bottom yeah. on the ledge. So we put her a pulley pen on, and she's not having trouble now. So the weight of the fish pulls it down, which is what it was originally designed for. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, very misty day today, isn't it? Yeah, there's a bit of mist. No wind at all. That's oh, nice. That's lovely. nice. Normally, oh. It's always windy, isn't it, when yeah. you come down here? It's nice today. That's, it's the sort of day when it can suddenly throw up a nice big fish. <laughs> it's these sort of days. You tend to come down think a nice chop, a nice bit of colour. You'll get a nice big fish or something, and it doesn't happen. And then you come down on a day like this, it's flat calm, nice and still, yeah, and yeah. bang, Mr. Cod comes along. The only thing is to get something about. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's, it's to bring it up. Five or six pound cod, it's got to be bringing it up. And that's no good to you here because you've got that length of concrete going yeah. out first. You just, and there's no way of getting down there. I so, definitely need your help to lift something bigger. <laughs> my arm chances like... are you, it might even come off. We don't know. You uh, might not get it up. Yeah. I've got my gloves in there because we're using braid. Um, yeah, I've got me. I've got one. I should have two in there. Because you used one the other day, didn't you? Yeah. I know I've got a pair of gloves in there. I should have them at the ready, really. Let me find the other one before I do get a. A decent fish on. No, that's not it. Right, we're on a glove hunt now. <laughs> Look at that. There it is. Got it. Yeah. Yeah, it's always a good idea when you're using braid is to keep a pair of gloves. These are the Fox Rage. Really good, actually. They are for, for fishing. They're, they're a nice, comfy, comfy glove. And they're perfect if you get something with braid, they've got the grip there for holding fish. If you get anything and you've got braid, you can get hold of it and pull it up with that. I wouldn't recommend doing it with your bare hands. Yeah. Definitely not. Right, I'll bring you back in a bit, guys. Well, I'll bring you back, guys. I'm not sure whether Lisa's got one on here. She's getting a few little pulls on her rod. Pulls, yeah. Can we give it a go? I'm away on from that. You're fine, are you? Yeah. See you again. See you, See you again. Okay. Yeah, thank, thank you, you mate. <laughs> Alright, we'll see if Lisa's got anything on here. I'm just gonna wind in. I'm gonna wind my one and take it as well because I think that's why. I think it's weed, there's lots of weed coming down. Keep, keep the rod up, just try to keep keep winding. I'll tell you when you to tell when stop, stop yeah. winding this time. So, yeah. yeah, you just never really like. I don't think you've got anything on there. No, mm. nothing this time. No, just sorry guys, it was just weed. Just a little rubbish. Right, so just, just watch it. And when your lead comes up to your eye height, right there, go on, keep going, keep going, keep going. There you go. Yeah, now you can bring that back, it comes straight to your hand. And you can put it on, right? I'm just going to reel, reel this one in, reel. 
and see because I did have a Yeah, this weed's pulling it down a bit, isn't it? Yeah. When it's gripping at the rod tip, that's the trouble. Yeah. I've got a crab. You've got, you got a crab? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, it's come off. It's come off. Though. We let go of it. <laughs> Right. You don't need to see me clearing weed off, so yeah. I'll bring you back in a minute, guys, yeah. when we've got these cleaned up. Right, I've brought you back, guys. Um, nothing much really happening. It's got a little bit mistier out there. Uh, quite a bit of weed at the moment. So at least was getting another little nibble just a minute ago. But yeah, we're still in it to win it. We're still giving it a try. <laughs> Can't moan about that. We've got a few hours. It's nearly half twelve. We're probably going to fish till what was say about two and then something like that. Half twelve. Uh, what did I say it was half twelve? Yeah, half one. Dinner. Well, if we ain't had anything by half one, we'll probably pack up. But if we get something, then we'll stay a bit longer. Um, this is one of those days where you don't know you're looking out there and you think at any time you could just get a, a good old pump. But so I thought I might go to some whiting about, but no whiting at the moment. I think I have got one on the stick. Yeah, it looks like you might have. Yeah. Have a look, have a go. Because I don't want them to get the No, I'll just move around a bit. Just gonna have a wind up see if you've got one on there. Can you tell how cloudy it is because even my uh my glasses haven't darkened up. How cloudy it is today. Normally they go dark pretty quick. Have you? No. 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 The worm ain't even got a chance to get wet. <laughs> Come over, I'll get that bit of weed off the top for you. That's it. 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 Right, I think what we'll do is we'll chuck you another worm on with that one. Worm's all right, you ain't had it on there long, but we'll put another one on and bulk it up a little bit. I'll have to get some more worms actually, I'm getting running out of worms now. So. And you don't use fresh. Well, I do use fresh, but the trouble is, is if you've got fresh, you've got to get them when you want to go, isn't you? I mean, yeah. I like to have them salted because I like them in the freezer ready. Yeah. And when I decide to go, I just grab them and go. That's it. So if I buy them fresh, I'll use them if I'm going that in that few days. But yeah. but we don't we don't go that way. No, so for me, it's better for, I just get them a salt, if I get a fresh lug, I'll just salt them. They work for me. It works for me. It's a nice big long worm on there then. Yeah, it'll give you a bigger, <laughs> a bigger bait then. Yeah. Alright, that's uh I'll say it's your page it up. Just pop 
that out there. See they still have a cast just to put her off a bit. You're on camera now, darling. We're gonna be filming ya. Right. Show me how it's done. <laughs> right, here she goes uh, Get out of the way of the bushes and stuff. Out of the way of the bushes and stuff, yep. Yeah. <laughs> you show me how it goes, girl. Go. Not bad. I got out there. It's far enough. I did just see there was that bloke on the other bank over there. He sort of ducked a bit. He thought he was coming over to the gym. Ah, you're doing all right. You're in the what? You're catching fish. You can't yeah. ask for more than that. Hey, majority of times you tend to find you'll overcast the fish anyway. It was weird, I always thought that actually. When, I always remember when I first started fishing, I used to catch, oh, right, it was different back then anyway, there was a lot more fish about. Um, although I say that, you had different, you didn't have the species of fish you've got about now. Oh, look, look oh I'm getting a bite. Yeah. I'll have to continue that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's, really it's going, going nuts here. Yeah. <laughs> It's a fish fish. It's a fish fish. It's, it's not, not, it's a it's haddock. A, it's a haddock. Yep. Oh, you got your haddock. I've got my haddock. You said that's the first one then, isn't it? You said yeah, you've yeah never... you don't get them down south. No, there you go. Oh, he's bleeding from the gills. That's all right because uh, he's a sizable, he's, he's coming home. Keepable. He's <laughs> a keepable size. Keepable. Right. <laughs> got a circle cook there. Haddock and chips tonight. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, oh, he, is, he is bleeding from the gills, but yeah. I think it's a sizable fish anyway. Um, yeah, he's bleeding a little bit there, so I'm going to dispatch him very quickly. Right. right. I shall bring you back in a minute, guys. Right. Okay, guys. So, yes, yeah, so I've got that in me. Um, me bag that's coming home for for dinner today hopefully we we'll get a, a, fishy, a hopefully we we'll get a couple i'm not i'm not i'm not missing out on a bit of haddock no. well i love haddock i know what people think getting it from the humber oh, well you've been in Lidl's lately <laughs> you've seen the way they keep their food come on <laughs> i think i'll, I'll eat out of the humber it's yeah. safer um but it's all the same water that comes from as, the sea. as lisa said that's a fish fish that's a fish fish that's a fish fish that's Fish, fish. That's your description of yeah. it. That's a fish fish. As in, other than flounder for me. So it's like fish fish. A flounder's a fish. I know, but it's like... Oh, but that's a fish. Yeah. That's, that's because fish. it's fish shaped, isn't it? It's a fish shape, right. yeah. Not, not flatty shape. <laughs> no. <laughs> so you call, I don't it a, know. you call it a fish fish. It's a fish fish. Right. That's but now I, I know. What did you said it was the fingerprints from... Like what, Jesus? Jesus used, when he fed the 5,000 yeah, with, with a fish. With a fish, so it's got the fingerprints on, the, on that fish, and that's what makes it a haddock. Yeah. Okay. That's what makes it a haddock, see? That's how you identify it. Because yeah, because yeah. it's got the fingerprints of... Jesus Christ himself. On the haddock, yes, see? Oh, it's blessed, and, it was blessed. Do you know why he held the haddock like that? Because of the smell of the fish. <laughs> because if you go back in time with Adam and Eve you know you know what happened they ate the apple and then they sort of 
had conundricals and stuff like that. And he felt a bit <laughs> dirty after that, so she went into the river to wash. And God turned around and said, I'll never get the smell off those fish now. <laughs> So that's a little bit of history so for you. <laughs> so that's why Jesus said to hold them like that. Yeah. Otherwise, he'd have smelly fingers. Yeah. There you go. Because he didn't have a nice little muddy water. bucket like this <laughs> where you can get a nice bucket of muddy water out of the Humber <laughs> to keep your hands washed. <laughs> and there you go. That's what that's all about. Right. A bit of history. A bit of history there. That's it. <laughs> Hope you guys learned that. <laughs> well, there you go. That's how it all happens. So. That's how it all happened. Mm. Oh, look, I'm getting a shaky, shaky, shaky. Oh, you're getting a bite, are you? Yeah. Come on, we need another haddock. Need another haddock. I mean, that's all right. We get a small fillet off of that, <laughs> but uh, a small fillet each, but really could do with another haddock if you can. Would be nice. Nice, nice codling. Be nice. Yeah. Two, three pound codling. That'd be a nice, uh, nice one to take back. Oh, yeah, it's fine. Well, it's worth staying for anyway, weren't it? Yeah. Like I said, we've only just started fishing up here, so I haven't fished on up previous years and. Haddock, well, you don't get them down on the south coast. You don't get haddock around Dungeness and places like that where all my, most of my fishing was. Um, I don't think you even really get them on Chisel Beach or that. I fish Chisel Beach a lot, but... Yeah. That can be a, a very hit and miss place in all Chisel Beach. Yes. So if you know where to go. Yeah, a lot of it is knowing where to go. 18 miles of, of beach, and when people say there's a place being caught at Chisel Beach, it's like, yeah, but there's 18 miles of it. But you get to know where to go. I mean, for that, go down to Compton and stuff. You can get it. It's uh, But when the plates are in, it's if you can get in there. And when the mackerel are in, if it's, you get a bloody space on the beach altogether. Mm -hmm. Right, so they camp up for weeks at a time there for the mackerel. Much the same as Dungeness, actually. As soon as someone says the mackerel are in the Dungeness, that's it. All the, all the tents appear and everything, and they tent up for, well, for how long. Just taking all the mackerel. Anyway, never mind. I always manage to fish all right. Oh, mine's going again, yep. Yeah. Look, rattle, rattle, rattle. Well, had it number two. Hopefully. Well, it was a totally different bite with the uh, Yeah. Trying to drag up a bit. Ready to. Yeah, my one's a bit going up. Make sure it's going one more time and then I'll bring it in. I don't like to be cooked in. Come on, yep, yeah, there's still something because I'm still getting that little. Yeah. And we're not getting no wheat now on the line. No. Actually, that tide... It just settled, didn't it? Is yeah. it coming back up again? No, no, it's no. not... No, not yet. It's not low tide yet. It's um, caught to one. Tide's dropped right off, so there's mm. not a lot of pull. And the weed seems to... Weed seems to have stopped. That's nice, actually. Yeah. I might actually put one out a bit further then. Yeah, I think we've got more chance. Put my whole squid out a bit further. Put <laughs> my whole squid out. 
my old squid out. I'll get <laughs> my, my old squid, squid out. out. <laughs> <laughs> my old squid, I should say. <laughs> I'll get my old squid out. Give that a go. <laughs> <laughs> so at least I've managed to christen both reels there you go once you've caught a fish on a new bit of tackle it's all go then isn't it no stopping you what a silly superstitions we have don't we <laughs> well I have <laughs> I, don't know if, I don't know whether other people have them I've not heard of that one before. <laughs> there might be something on mine actually it was going. I might give it though because I don't want to. Have a look. <laughs> have a look. There's no pro no worries in having a look, is there? No. Oh, please put the block. Poor thing. And just in case she has got one on there. Mm. So I'll leave you on for a bit anyway, because otherwise it'll be such a short video. <laughs> you'll think it's an advert. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, nope. it hasn't been touched at all. But... I'll swing it round, I'll do the wind for you. Sorry. Hasn't been touched. No. But it was definitely getting some good knocks Put there. Put the rod down, put that on there. And I'll... That's it. Just pop it on there, I'll wrap you a bit of squid on the bottom. Okay. I've got a bit of squid already cut there. Right, a little bit of squid on the bottom just to add as a bit of a target. <laughs> yeah, between the, that would have been good, wouldn't it? <laughs> Try and cast that one out. And pull the whole thing down. <laughs> As we serve another cast. Uh, well, I just brought you back, guys, and just trying to get a few knocks on this left hand rod. Just recast the right hand rod. I took the uh, whole squid off and I've put a bit of bluey, a chunk of bluey on that, and see what that does. Um, Just get a couple of little taps on the on the left hand rod. So 
you will see nice day everyone ten past one now so yeah see what happens mm -hmm. I thought I mean one had I would have thought one had it was swimming about on his own out there <laughs> we mm. want another one yeah I don't, I don't see that one haddock is just swimming about on his own going out for a mooch. There would be a shoal of them out there. Going out for a mooch. So, <laughs> going out for a mooch, yeah. <laughs> a mooch round. <laughs> and they'd be more of a, a shoal fish, so you'd have a few of them, wouldn't you? Mm. You would think. Oh, mine's done. We are getting rattled. We're getting, yeah. we're getting bites. That's what Kev said, didn't he? For you, he said he had he like said six, bites. six or seven bites, but he just couldn't hit, hit anything from no. contact with it. Yeah, mine's going low. Yeah. Just had a little walk. Could be crabs, but we haven't had much crab attention down here. It's been no. pretty baits are coming, but if they're not if they're not getting a, like a fish, then it's um, coming back as it goes out. So it's all right. No crabs. No. <laughs> you had one crab, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, that one a little bit earlier, and that's and what I mean. That, that, that come back, and the, the bait was nipped in half in mm -hmm. the middle. So. You know you've had a crab at it, but yeah. the other baits have come back as they've gone out. That whole squid that came in, is it? Yeah. I mean, it's a hole. Yeah. Nothing to touch that. And that flounder was being a bit greedy. It was, wasn't it? Was, it was it was squid could have turned around and gave it a slap. <laughs> <laughs> Shame actually because it was like this year, I think this year and maybe a little bit last year um, that they was getting all the squid off the shore mm. um, especially all around Brighton and Eastbourne and all that area I was getting squid squid off the beach there they, they're coming in the way our climates are changing there I mean these fish are coming in uh, squid and that are coming in I think that's what where, where are we going yeah yeah Definitely have a little, a little tweak. Just, just want to get a bottom of the bite. Let's move it a little bit. Yeah, because I mean, they're getting a lot of tuna in that down that way now as well, all off the south coast. Starting to see the tuna more and more. Yeah, they weren't, weren't getting them so much off the beaches. You got them a lot off the piers. I was getting them off of the Brighton, Brighton Marina, they get them. Um, get a lot of them down in Dorset around Weymouth. That's good. But they was getting loads. I mean, I know a couple of boats. I said you could have just got them with a net. <laughs> just scooped them out of a net. Yeah. They was that close on the beach. The squid coming in. Nice sized squid as well. Nice then, because you can fill your freezer up with fresh squid. <laughs> Some of the ones they get, get like that down at Weymouth. Big squid like that, yeah. Off of the Weymouth Pier. But I wasn't down there for it, I was up here, I'm on my side. I don't think you're going to get them in here. <laughs> no. Yeah, my lure rods and all my lures and stuff, they're all packed away in the loft, didn't I? Mm. Don't get a chance to use them so much round here. Mm. I like that going out spinning. Well, we've got many piers around here for, for that sort of thing, isn't it? There's well, that one at Whitby. So if you go to Whitby and all that, yeah. you've got it. Um, 
I'm not sure. I haven't really looked up for it. It's, uh, I don't mind going. I mean, just go show that I had it today. If I had it yeah. been feeding a bit more, mm -hmm. then. Then they could just suddenly switch on if they're about. Yeah. Oh, the other one's going that way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. oh. <laughs> So I'm definitely having a nibble there. Mm. Just gonna... Ready? It's the biggest bait, so I've got to give it enough time to get it, get it in. But I liked the bluey last time I was down there, didn't That's I? That's right, yeah. Mum and Kit's getting a few knocks. <laughs> Yeah, very happy with those Mag 4s anyway. I know I've been out for a while, but as I said, I'm never bothered. I wasn't that bothered with going for them, but then I thought, well, I will. Um, I must say, quite impressive, they're very quiet when you cast with them. Where you normally you cast, you get that... Vroom, goes, it no, didn't make very, any noise. No, they're really quiet. Yeah. Very quiet. Yeah, nice reel. Cast them well as well. Yeah, very good. And they're straight, I haven't done nothing with them, they're straight out of the box. I don't even know where the magnets are set, I just, I just cast it and it went all right, so I've left it as it is. Mm. <laughs> I haven't played about with it as yet. You can't really up here, because it's, you get a proper cast with it. It's just rattle, 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 and mm. then stop, won't it? Yeah. Little buggers. Yeah. <laughs> little buggers they are, little buggers. Little buggers. Well, I've had rattles. It could be fish, could be sat on there. It's a bit like flounders, isn't it? They sit. Yeah, oh, oh yeah, the other one's down again. The one on the right, yeah. If it goes again, I'm going to cover you. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Because it's not that. Not that big a bite because I've got braid on, mm. it doesn't have to actually do a lot to give you a good bite. Mm. Which is flying about. Mm. Yeah, oh, go yeah, for it. Yeah, go for it. Right, let's have a look. <laughs> no, that's the last one you can see on there. No? It's definitely a good bite. No. Hmm. It's probably quite safe in the middle, it's a fish bite, isn't it? Mm.
nothing. It's like crabs. Crabs? Yeah. I might have a check on mine then because mine was getting the yeah, nipples. I would. Yeah. That's crabs having a go at that. Yeah, there's a nice bit of bluey on that, and that's uh, crabs have just sort of been picking away at it. It's got a nice bit of smell to it, but we'll take that off and put a fresh bit on. One worm left after this one, darling. That's oh. us out of worms. Got plenty of squid, Bluey. I'll we'll have to get some more worms. I tried getting some, didn't I? I bet it's been a nightmare to try and get worms. There you go, that's what it is. It's good for that. worm on and popping my hook through there I'm going to twist it round put it over the worm <clears throat> and then I'm just gonna use one of my little bait and needles just to give a little bit of strength and then I'm gonna get some elastic wrap around there Slide my pen all down. That's the last one you said. Oh, you've got one more left than that one. A few twists around there. Put that worm through it. Right there. Wash. There we go. Yeah. Done. That's a big one. Like you can cut that in That'll be alright. A little bit of elastic sticking out there. Just pop that off. That's it, right? Let's get out there. See if that gives us another header. <laughs> Big lug worm in there, left, I'll leave that one for you, for your rubber line. 
rinse. over with the little tronics uh, up and over clips the little spring spring clips I like those oh, it's a nice bait nice going out tide there is out there even a you get a four or five pound for the could actually flip the rod so I like to put the ratchet up right what have you got to gel right I'll turn this off yeah I'll yeah. bring you back when we've got Lisa sorted out all right guys I've brought you back we've just had a nice fresh bait up this is uh basically our last cast now yeah. so we'll just see what this does it's 25 to 2 um, we said we'd pack up at two anyway, get back and have dinner. I've got haddock for dinner. I don't know what you got. <laughs> worms. I have some squid left here. <laughs> if you I want. I even have got worms. <laughs> I can empty that out. I'll make that water all salty, won't it? <laughs> Fish won't like that. <laughs> Empty all that salt back into the sea. Look back from whence it came. Yeah. Right. That's all good. That bait back in. The Tronics. The Tronics bait pack. That's quite good actually. It keeps it all nice yeah. and yeah. fresh in there. Got me bait flask that'll keep me bluey in. The bluey tends to go a bit mushed, doesn't it? You know, I just cut. Come on, it's still frozen. Still nice and frozen. Sorry, that I cut it up into halves and then put it in. I mean, that would be a nice size bait if I was actually ray fishing. I'd use them like that, but I'm not ray fishing. Ray isn't even here, is he? No, <laughs> he didn't turn up. <laughs> Very calm, very still. It's never been like this. We've never had it as calm as this, isn't it? We haven't. No, every time we come down here, it's bloody windy as hell, isn't it? Yeah. So it's nice like this. I would have liked the beach, the beach today, actually. Oh, uh, that would have been nice. Yeah. Place, yeah. Would have been nice, but that's all right. And don't forget, guys, if you do see us down here, come and say hello, and you can have a free bait needle. Okay, like that. Don't have to have them. If you don't want it, you just say, don't, I don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> but if you do want it, there you go. I'll have them there. Right. Look this out. You can say, no, 10 minutes. Yeah. It's yeah, gone 10, a bit, bit quiet. Actually, it was getting, it's getting by today. It's got, it seems to have gone a bit quiet, actually. Yeah. So... Yeah. We we'll see what see what happens, won't we? Well, 
if we get anything, I should bring you back. And if I don't, then I won't. <laughs> so I will say to the pip, and I will catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. All right, so here we are at home, guys. I've filleted me haddock. I've got the two fillets there. I've got my batter made up there <laughs> and the oil getting heated up there. Peas are on the go, chips are in the air fryer. <laughs> so I'll give you a quick snap when it's dished up. <laughs> right, so there we go, guys. Haddock and chips and peas. <laughs> Mine, Lisa's. We so, shall have a fishy on our little dishy. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> there we go. So I'm going to now enjoy Toodle Pip. Bye guys!